Hi, I am Dr. Hiranapa B. Udnur, Consultant Pulmonologist and Sleep Medicine Specialist, practicing at Inspire Speciality Clinic, Sakar Nagar, Bangalore. Many people will snore. All snorers are not sleep apnea. It's a spectrum of a disease. A snoring, then you have apneic spells, choking sensations. If it goes towards too much severity, you get a sleep disorder breathing. Then you have excessive daytime sleepiness. And then we call it as obstructive sleep apnea. And the spectrum is obesity hypoventilation where you have a central component to it. Uh, so all snorer, if you have any upper respiratory infection also, we get snoring. Sometimes a mild snoring will not uh, will be there because of viral infections or allergic rhinitis. Uh, if at all you take a local antihistaminics and decongestants, it should be okay. And uh, this is just snoring. So, but anything more than that, if snoring is affecting your quality of life and uh, it uh, has more of nighttime symptoms, nocturnal symptoms like uh, um, suddenly breathing stops in the night time or uh, uh, heart rate variability happens too much and oxygen falls frequently and when it starts affecting in your daytime symptoms you feel unrefreshed in a daytime and you feel fatigued and tired and you have excessive daytime sleeping sleepiness and based on the diagnostic criteria once you have a, a apnea hypopnea index of more than five then we call it as uh, uh, sleep apnea uh, in adults so there's a so sleep apnea requires treatment uh, based on the severity if it's mild you have a dental and um, other modality of treatments like weight weight reductions sometimes positional therapy is advised and uh, lifestyle modifications uh, there are certain surgeries available if there is any mechanical problem especially in a pediatric age group and um, if it is severe they need a positive airway pressure therapy or a CPAP therapy uh, so sleep apnea and snoring has to be distinguished all snoring doesn't require a screening for sleep apnea if somebody is having snoring and they have a daytime symptoms based on the F word sleepiness scale and there are different kind of questionnaires are there stop bank questionnaires and uh, many other uh, scoring systems are there but um, um, the overall the understanding is that if somebody is having uh, snoring and choking sensations and if they have having their daytime symptoms like whatever I have mentioned then we suspect obstructive sleep apnea so sleep apnea and uh, snoring are a spectrum it may start with snoring and you end up having uh, sleep apnea um, if at all your weight increases and other risk factors develops